Welcome, my name is Michiel from Bitnami Support and today I'm going to show you how to configure HTTPS for your Bitnami application using an existing certificate. So if you want to do the same, you need a running instance using any Bitnami stack that uses Apache like Bitnami Lamp, WordPress, Magento and many more. And you also need to have a valid certificate and key file and you need to have a domain name configured which points to the instance's IP address. These are the steps we will follow. First, we will upload the existing certificate and key using FileZilla, which is an SFTP application. Then we will back up the instance's dummy certificate and key and replace them with the new ones. After that, we will set the right permissions and then we will restart Apache and check if everything is working. So, to start, we will upload the certificate files. I have connected to my instance using FileZilla. If you want to know how to do that, please check docs.bitnami.com. All I have to do now is to select these files and drag them to the window on the right. That's uploaded, so now we will access the instance using SSH for the rest of the steps. I've SSH'd into the instance. As you can see, the uploaded certificates are in my home folder here. So the next step is to create a backup of the dummy certificates. I'm first going to CD into the main Apache configuration file folder, I mean. Here you can see the dummy certificates and key. So we are first going to make a backup of those files using the mv commands. So now we will place the real certificates in this folder by moving them and renaming them at the same time. And next, we need to set the right permissions for the certificates, making them owned and only readable by the root user. Oh, we need to do that with sudo, of course. And we need to change the permissions to read only for the root user. And now all we need to do is restart Apache and check if it's working.
So let's check if it's working. So in Chrome, you go to the URL through HTTPS. And as you can see, here's the icon that shows that the connection is secure and the certificate is valid. So that's all. Thank you for watching.